Okay, next step in the quest. Last rites. Okay, I'm sure this is back on the moon. That it is. Okay, I will see you guys on the moon. Okay, you've got the crystal. All you have to do now is fill it with Crota's soul. The hive are in the middle of some kind of funeral, so... Not a funeral. A death ceremony. Crota's essence is being prepared for the next realm. Right. So when you get to this funeral, Oryx will be watching close. Use Rasputin's cloak to slip past the Taken. Find Crota's soul, wrap it up, and get out. So it's, it's not a funeral, it's a death ceremony. Where exactly are we headed? Ah. When the death singers begin their song, you'll know we are close. So in the dark below... What she's trying to say is that she doesn't know. Don't worry, I'll keep my ear to the ground. So, and I will try not to step on his head. Okay, they're done talking. So this is uh, basically a bunch of areas in the Dark Below, which is the first expansion, the raid. So you go through this all this uh, dark area and you keep lighting these lamps. You eventually make it to this plate, which builds this bridge. So this is really cool. So we're, we're basically going back to where the Crota raid, where we had to kill Crota. So after you made it through all the lamps and you created that bridge, you would run down this tunnel into the light. Stay out of sight. We need you back alive. You have the frequency, Ghost? And your modifications. We'll be ready. Then move quietly and unseen like death. Unseen like death. Let's hope this works. Cloaking. Nice. I can't see you. Can you see me? All right, so this is the second little area. Keep your distance. They can't see you, but they can still smell you. Eris can replace her ship. We can't replace you. Cross the chasm. Enter their world. Okay, so what we had to do then in the Crota Raid was you had to stand on the plate right over there and build this other bridge while you were fighting off all these waves of stuff. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. What is that? What is that? I guess that's the smell area where they can smell me. Oh, gotta be careful here. Oh, heck, a big ogre. Oh, that ogre's got a big old smell sense, smell circle. All right, so after we created this, oh, do I need to, do I need something? Oh, I gotta get this ball. Okay. Gotta get the orb. A two mask. Careful. We've still got to avoid them. They don't see this little thing I just floating and walking around? Thing. Oh, I can't do my, my thrust. Can I run and jump up that thing? There we go. Man, you'd think they would see all this crazy stuff happening. Okay, so anyways, when you had to get across this, you had to do it one at a time until you had everybody over here. This is actually a really cool raid. I, I mean, some people didn't like it for various reasons. I really enjoyed the quarter raid. Oh man, I'm getting trapped. Okay. Okay. Split down the middle. Whew. Okay. We're doing good. We're doing good. You think they heard?
heard that. I hope not. Then you have to come in here and you go jump down this pit. The Death Singers. They are preparing Crota's soul for the next realm. Follow their cry. It was just as this when I walked in the dark. The wretched songs in the wind as Ariana fell. <clears throat> Reach Crota's tomb and take what remains of his soul. All right, cool. There are a lot of tombs here. How do we find Crota's? You know it when you see it. So that's Crota's tomb. What's cool is this is the stage where you would fight Crota for the raid. He was up on that stage and you killed him right there. So his tomb is right where you killed him. That's cool. Sure, I stay away from. Whoa, whoa. Oh man, is that is that wizard gonna come over here? Sure, hope not. Easy. I think we found it. Man, they are creepy looking. Let the crystal drink deep from Crota's death essence. It's working. How much do we need to pass us an ascended hive? Only a taste, but steal all you can. Something's wrong. We're exposed. Uh-oh. Watch for transmat. Get out of there. We must have quota soul. How do I get out of here? We've got enough. Lock for transmat, ghost. I can't. Everything is corrupted. Ah. Uh. Yeah, I feel like I'm gonna have to kill all these taken. Stay alive. We've got to make it back. Maybe if I just clear out the room, we'll be good. Ah, oh, I don't like the look of that guy up there. There we go. Protect me, wall of fire. Is there a bloopity bloop? Oh no! They can spawn behind me? What is he bloopiting blooping? I want to scan wherever he wants me to scan, but I don't know what he wants me to scan. There we go. Well, it's not scanning. And they're not advancing, so I guess I can come out here? I'm sure I need to kill a certain amount of these guys. Looks like a new wave is coming in. Ah oh, man, that was horrible aim. Getting a little hairy. Still, not yet anything I can't handle. What is that? Oh no! Ah, crud, another one of these guys. There we go. Where am I going? Ah! 
Where do you want me to go? I don't know where she wants me to go. Oh, oh she just teleported me out of there. I could do with so little time. You pulled us out. One of Tolan's tricks. There is nothing I fear more than the dark, but I will not lose another guardian. Interesting. You've imprisoned the last whisper of Crota's soul. It is left to you now. Find Oryx on the Dreadnought. Destroy him. Well, all right. Luckily, uh, she came and got us out of there because it was getting a little hairy. I was about to have to bust out the super. Hammer time. So let's see here. We've got an upgrade to our subclass. I don't want to use that. Are these arms better? They are. Uh, Ingram. Ooh, a 205 shotgun. So we can get rid of this one. We can get rid of this one. And we also have two bounties we can turn in. So let's see if this gets us to 40. Oh, there we go, 40! Woohoo! All right. So we're gonna go ahead and put on the Take a Knot. And we're gonna forego this gun and we're gonna move over to. Oh, actually, you know what? Let's keep that for now because I'm gonna use this the Telesto. It's a really good fusion rifle. Got one more. Wow, we're just getting stronger by the second, aren't we? Your hammer of soul will alter its fight path to seek out your enemies. Oh, that's cool. All right, so what's the next step in our quest? Okay, we have to do that, but first we're gonna go ahead and go to uh, the tower and talk to Zavala. So I will see you guys in the tower. Let's see what Zavala has to say. Okay, as per the custom, I'm gonna turn in our engrams first. <coughs> Excuse me. My voice is cutting out. I'm still getting over a little bit of my sickness. Ooh, a new rocket launcher. And the one we have is better. So, real quick, I'll show you now that we're 40 uh, some of the items that we have here. So, this is the Take a Knot, which is the exotic helmet we're gonna use first. So here's the exotic perk. The, the main exotic perk for each of the exotic items, whether it's weapons or armor, is unlocked from the get-go in the beginning. It's this one right here. 
air traffic control. So all rocket launchers gain tracking, radar remains visible while zooming, and hev uh, uh, zooming with heavy weapons, and heavy ammo drops increase when using a rocket launcher. So that is awesome. Because uh, having tracking is very helpful, especially in PvE stuff. And I've actually not gotten too many rocket launchers to drop with tracking. So this is cool. This basically makes any of them have tracking. And uh, the Telesto, which is this fusion rifle we're going to be using, I actually already have a lot of it leveled up because I've been using it on the Hunter. It is uh, fusion projectiles attach and detonate when uh, with a delayed void blast. So it, it does a lot of damage. It's really good at bringing down shields in one fell swoop. All right, so let's go talk to Mr. Zavala. This should be the quest where that we are completing for turning uh, for reaching level forty. I don't know if he's gonna have like a reward for us or just another step for another part of the quest. I'm not sure. Oh, arc void solar. We're gonna take this one because we're working on our new void subclass. Oh, and check that out. We also got a shader. Mercurial Dawn. Eh, I'm not feeling it. Here's the uh, Sunbreaker one that we got. It's kind of like a... It's supposed to be orangish, I think. Kind of. But it's just more brown. So we're going to stick with Bitter Steel. Actually, I'm going to delete a couple of these to make room. Yeah, that's good. Okay. And our next step in this quest is to go back to the Dreadnought. 